everyone, it's Miss Christine with Momspiration412, founder of EduPlay. Welcome to EduPlay Learning with Miss Christine. Today what we're going to do is we are going to do a rhyming match. So on your hot chocolate sheet here, it has all kind of pictures and it has rhyming words. So you could play this game a couple different ways. First, you could let your kiddos help you cut them out or you guys can cut them out yourself. Now remember, on the back of this, it has the number card. So you may have already cut these out. And what you could do is you can mix them up, shuffle them up a little bit, and you can lay them flat on a table, okay? I'll just lay them up here so you guys can see. We have cap, we have hen, jet, bat, map, hat, pig, I'm going to lay them here on the table now, dig, net, cup, pen, and we have one more that fell, pup. Let me grab that. And our little pup here. So now what you could do is you can have them all laid out. If you want to have just a few, maybe four matches, um, you could do that certainly. And you could take some away, okay? Make it easier for the kiddos or make it more challenging. But you could read, they could pick two cards or pick one card. And they could say, okay, cat. K app. That's the easiest way for them to start listening to those. K app. What other picture makes that app at the end? So we're going to rhyme that ending sound, the app part. K app. And if they know, if it's difficult for them, if they can't figure it out, give them two choices. So, so my card is cap, and I'm going to hold up these two, and I'm going to say. M app or b at. M app or b at. Which one rhymes with cap? Cap. K app. Very good. So you guys can match up the two. Match them up. Cap and map. All right. So you could do this a couple different ways. You could do a matching game where they're all out. You could flip them over. You could even try to do like a memory kind of a game. So there's a couple different activities and I would love to know how your kiddos do with it. Even if they are just identifying the picture, okay? And you tell them the rhyming word. So if they pick pig and you say, okay, pig rhymes with dig. Find the picture or find the card that has a shovel on it. So you could do it that way as well, where they're identifying the pictures that go with the words that rhyme together. So again, we're just trying to make it so it's challenging for those that can rhyme. It's good with the pictures for those that need to identify pictures, trying to make it so everyone in between can do these activities together at home. If at any time you feel like this activity is either too high or too low for my kiddos, please reach out and I would love to help you out with that. All right, so let me know how they do with this rhyming activity. I can't wait to see what they know and what they learn. All right, guys, have a great day. Remember, see each moment as a chance to learn, create, and have fun. Bye, guys.